This is Two Second Lena Tulsa with yet another lesson on standards. Notice these two yardsticks that these digits are to the left of the inch marks. That is until you get to the double digits. And at the double digits, this one is still to the left, but this one straddles. So from one yardstick to the next, there's no standard there. There isn't a standard color between them. The font looks relatively close to each other. The thickness of the lines, however, not. This one is clearly thicker than this one. Making sure that these two ends are even with each other, I'm going to go every six inches and show you something neat. Focus. Those match up pretty well. At 12, hey, we've got an issue. Why don't they match up? Shouldn't an inch be a standard no matter who uses it? And 18, well, clearly an issue. Now, this one had 12 that was greater than this 12, but now the 18 is less than this 18. Uh, something's not right. This 24 is clearly shorter than this 24, and by roughly a 32nd, maybe just a hair more. Get down to 30, and well, now it's getting longer. It's longer at 30 than it was at 24 relative to the other one, and 36. Well, at the 35 and a half mark, they are, they magically the same, even though at 35, it's just a hair off of each other. And clearly at 34, there is clearly no standard. So maybe the lesson here is that if you use one device to go measure something, use it to go measure everything else relative to that job. But there's no guarantee that your measuring device is going to be standard to what somebody else is using if you aren't both on the same job. So if you're in one area and they are in another and you're using two different measuring devices, you can have issues with your job. And this is <laughs> two second lean in Tulsa and perhaps enlightening somebody on standards.